Hello there, everybody. Welcome back to my Space Engineer series. Now, with this fancy smancy new DirectX 11 update, I decided to start a brand new exploration survival series. It has been some time since I actually did, like, a let's play gameplay. I mean, back when I was still playing survival, um, I think I was just doing update videos, which is kind of lame, but that's okay. Anyway, we're here, um... Jester, who doesn't even have this game, crashed our ship into this asteroid. We're all like, Jester, look out, there's a big rock. And he's like, what? And he crashed, and now we've lost the front end of the ship, and we have to somehow scrape by and survive. Damn it, Jester, even when you don't play the game, you mess things up for us. And my oxygen has been refilled from bottles. How much do I have left? Oh, 58%. So you get two full uses and then a partial one. Totally got off topic there a little bit. But, yes, so, brand new exploration series. It's going to be great. DirectX 11. Uh, for the most part, I only activated DirectX 11 mods to keep everything pretty. But there's a couple things that I was like, eh, I really want this. So I activated it anyway. And, of course, I have Blob with me, who's not actually Woo! Blob because I haven't updated that yet. Hopefully they will. And I am yellow like a banana. Or you just zipping around up there. But yep, new faction name. We are now the United Blog Blobdom of. Wait, I've screwed up the name. United Blobdom of Kingdoms and States. United Blob. Yeah, that's right. It just looks weird. Okay. Ux. <laughs> yes. Yes, Ux. But let's go ahead and get started to make sure that we don't die a horrible death via suffocation. Right. So. Oh, there actually was a source of uranium that I found, but uh, I think we have enough in the ship to get by. Plus, we have the solar panel, so we'll definitely be able to uh, to restore our energy there for the time being. Speaking of, I'm at like 60%, and uh, I'm just going to go ahead and take care of that. I'm on 10. <laughs> Man dash. <laughs> I may not have noticed. Mad dash, mad dash. It's okay, we have medical room up. Scavengers, the supplies. Okay. Yeah, no, I like these oxygen bottles, though. They're kind of nice. <laughs> I really haven't played a serious survival game since they added those in. Yeah, because that platform that we had with, like, that hangar bay and the... We are just messing around with the pressurization, and it was, I was, that's when I was doing the, um... Like, the updates... Yeah. So that's cool. These hallways are cramped. So cramped. Well, um What do you think in what do you think of starting to uh grind down some of the stuff in the front, some of the armor, and we can get a little platform going perhaps. No problem. I think that'll be uh, quite nice. Either that or we can make the ship functional again, but uh, personally I'm not a huge fan of the red ship. Never mind. Put the blue out of the two. Yeah, I kind of like the blue. I actually used that in one of my little series that I had going on, but then they updated it and added ice, and that's actually what ended my uh, my last gameplay series on this. I'm actually going to adjust my sound a little bit, because the grinding is a little bit loud. And I remember for my interview with CK, I had actually uh, changed the audio balance, so it's even with uh, the sounds my computer uh. makes and my voice. So, yeah, before, Tobias, you would be slightly quieter than me in Skype. Oh, oh, I so see. It is racism. Yeah, yeah totally racist. We're, we're both white. Mm-hmm. Racism. But I am blonde, and so that makes me better. Just be that way. I'm Australian. I'm better. Mm, debatable. But, as I recall, uh, we are playing on... Uh, 10 times inventory, I maxed out the grinder and welder speeds, however, I'm pretty sure that I left the assembler efficiency at realistic, as well as the refinery speed. So, yeah. There's that. So not completely hardcore, but uh, it'll take a lot more than it usually does from what I usually play on to actually uh, make things. Which is fine, because fairly soon we always end up swimming in so many resources. Yeah. 
Like, this will actually give it some meaning. I really like this ex sped up grinding, because I played for so long before they added that option. <laughs> like, I was and just most tired. of it was spent grinding, right? Most of it was spent grinding, yes. Like, yeah. They changed the coloration of some things. Yeah, I'm just noticing that. Yeah, like the grinding, it's not that deep red. It's uh, yeah. kind of faded. Kind of like it. Not sure. Yeah. Nice little iron deposit right here. That Jester crashed into. Damn it, Jester. <sighs> Can I kill him this time? <laughs> Permission to potato granted. Yes. You may potato. Mincing potato. Uh, anyway, uh, I'm going to start using some of the steel. Ooh, ah! Let's not grind each other. Uh, it's okay. okay. I didn't get hit. If you want. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to start uh, making a little platform. Um, right now, environmental hazards are off. So, yeah. I will probably actually turn those on later. I meant to turn them on. But that's okay. Actually, from this side, since it seems, as I recall, the, ast the meteors always come from the sun side, we just get totally... Uh, Hammered? Totally pummeled, yeah. Although I don't set it on the higher settings when I do it. But yeah, uh, I think it's time for a little, uh, just a little simple platform. It's not going to be anything fancy. New station. Ooh. Station rotation. B, right? Yep. Oh, look at that. And what were the downfalls to that? I don't remember. Do you remember? You, if you disconnect part of the station, you can't reconnect it like you used to be able to. Okay, well, I never really do that. Because they're on different planes. Okay. Oh, no, that's super, super freaking sweet. Actually, I'm going to build this right into the asteroid, but right by the uranium deposit, is what I'm going to do. Like, right freaking there. Freaking sharks with freaking laser beams attached to their freaking heads. You need to calm down. No, I will not calm down. That's it's not enough. a situation to be calming. Thank you for understanding. Yeah, that didn't end how you expected it to go now, did it? Yes, it did. No. I, I'm, I'm as angry as you are about Jester crashing the ship. I mean, at least he died in the crash. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good riddance. It's okay, Jester never watches my videos anyway, unless uh, it's that requested You're... Verdun video where apparently I'm not going to spill it. What, you had your gamma turned down? <laughs> yes, yes that. Which, the views were really squirrely on that for some reason. Not really sure what's going on with that. Oh, okay, cool. But, I think it's fixed either that or it got a crap ton more views on over the night. Well, crap ton is in like 40. It's not a whole lot, but... Yeah, you'll still feel proud of yourself. I'm on 3% energy. Oh, dang. <laughs> Do you have anything <laughs> useful on you? Nope. Not really. Don't die, don't die. No, I'll make it. It's okay. Oh, I've glitched in the door again. This is why you can't take your blob anywhere. It'll just run out of energy and die on you. I didn't die. I made it. On 1%. Okay. I actually, that happens to me sometimes because I disabled the HUD warnings because they're just creepy. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm the, regretting doing that already. The first time I heard it, I like, peed myself. I was like, what the crap is that? <laughs> energy, no. Like, you don't have to say it like that. Or how it just comes out of nowhere, too. Anyway, I need to break some uh, some rock here to make room for this platform, although I'm breaking a whole lot more. This brings me back to the building that asteroid base where I, for the most part, haul it out by, uh, at least the initial parts, by hand. That was pretty crazy. That was with Rico. He hasn't been on in a while. No, he hasn't. Been on his own server. Yeah. I need to get him on Elite Dangerous. Because Power Play is out now. Elite Dangerous is fun. It is. It is a lot of fun. You guys should get it. Well, look into it first, so you don't blame me if you don't like it. You just <laughs> blindly buy it, because uh, some guy on YouTube said to get it. 
<laughs> yep. <laughs> Except knowing my luck, I'll get the blame for it, even though it's your channel and yep. you're the one who said it. Wait, it's my channel? Since when? I mean, it's it's my channel. Yeah, it's my name's Trevoli. I really like the light effects on this. The sun was really glistening off of that rock. Everything's moving away. They changed how uh, how well you can mesh um, like armor blocks with asteroids. Because before, I'm pretty sure I could have gotten a block in there. I mean, yeah. I think you're lying to me. I'm not lying. You should just see my asteroid base one more time. So many of the blocks are just built like halfway into the uh, the side of the asteroid. Made for really it. nice flush surfaces, though. I dropped something for you. It's floating away. Oh, bulletproof glass for what? I don't know. Bulletproof for activities. Yeah, well, I'm just I'm literally just grinding the old chip apart. Oh, okay. That's cool. So I dropped something for you. <clears throat> And I should go get some uh, energy. Because I don't want to die. Wait, it was that way. Yeah, it's that way. Uh, da, 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 da. We should totally uh, like expand that platform a little more and then enclose it and pressurize it. And then we can dig into the asteroid and have oxygen in there. Be good. That'd be fun. We nestled right up against that uh, uranium, so that's pretty nice. Mm. Alright, filled up. And I have so much stone. I might just send it flying off into the distance. Oop, game no. seized up a little bit. There it is. It's so useful, though. Whoa, there's all sorts of stuff floating around out here. Well, was it me? I don't know what happened. Wait, was I grinding and... No, that's not the case. I mean, I, I was able to collect all that stone. I don't even know why I bothered. To sp I just... Steps of space with you. Okay, it's not going that fast, but be gone. Good riddance. Don't come back, you hear? I chucked all of my stuff <clears throat> into the large container for you. All right. Oh wow, that's a lot of steel plate and stuff too. Uh, underneath the platform we're building, there's a decent yeah. amount of material just floating around. So there is. Yeah, not sure what's going on. I might I find a small cargo container from the red ship and move it up into the um, onto the platform. It's the refinery there. Oh no! I hit something. No! No! Come back! <laughs> ah, there we go. <laughs> oh, apparently there's no cargo. What kind of cargo containers do we have here? Apparently there's none. Oh wait, there's one large one at the top. Cargo. Yeah, there is a large one, but that. And take a few trips. Uh, ba -ba <clears throat> Large cargo container. <laughs> Itchy ear. Stop that nonsense ear. No, I did it again. <clears throat> God damn it. <laughs> come back, come back. This is, again, Let's... why we can't have anything nice. It's just not picking up that I'm <clears throat> pressing T. There we go. <laughs> From Australia. Hey, Australia is a lovely country. You can't be so mean to it. Like it has feelings. It does now, huh? Hmm. It's a little weird, drunk. but uh, I'm just gonna back away slowly and uh, just uh, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> but we—it's Jesus' fault. Yeah, it's always Jesus' fault. Damn it, Jesus! Small cargo container. What does it take? Derp interior plates. To place it. I'll just start grabbing all of the things. Interior plates. Interior plates. Okay. And then I know it needs construction components. We'll probably need a display. Probably won't need motors. Some computers. What's that sound? It's breezy. What's that? Sounds like What's there's that? a breeze. Or is your hair f flowing uh, seductively in a breeze? Nope, I had my microphone muted, so it wasn't me. Oh. Oh. I have no idea what that was, then. No idea what that was. Anyways, that's okay. Mysterious noises. Um, let's go there. 
Do 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 Yeah. I I heard it again. I think it's my jetpack. But it doesn't always play. Alright, so small cargo container. I kinda wanna get an idea as to how this platform needs to be so I know where to put this. Fuck it, I'm just gonna place it right right here. Right, right, screw it, right there. There we go. And just start welding it. Okay, I need... Oh, I did need motors, damn it. That's actually the only thing I'm missing. Two motors. <laughs> oh, there's that cargo container. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Two motors. No, I only want two. Two. Seven? Thirty-seven. Two. There we go. Numbers are hard. Yeah, there's that sound again. It only plays sometimes. It's definitely from my jetpack, but like I'm flying around now and I don't hear that sound. I, mean, I don't hear any noise from my whatever. jetpack. It's whatever. I'm going to start emptying out the contents of this large cargo container a little bit. Although it'll be horribly boring to watch, but that's okay. That's okay. I'm, this is space engineers. This is space engineers. This is the things that you gotta do if you wanna be a space engineer. You have to move things. It's not all babes and glory. <laughs> You're gonna say fun and games and then realize that it is fun and it's also a game. Yeah, exactly. I'll say. Because, yes. And I know I've pointed this out before in my videos, but I really like the new texture for this, the gyroscopes in DirectX 11. And yeah, it's DX9. pretty good. I got sick and tired of glitching through the doors. I just grinded them. There you go. Mm -hmm. Don't do that at home, kids. Just grind down your doors. I'm not going to be part <laughs> of this system. There's bulletproof glass floating through space. Oh 80 units God. of it. Well, it wasn't many this time. <clears throat> and what's here? This is interior plate. 110 of them. Resources. I've got space precious. in my inventory. Hmm. No, I don't think I've grinded anything with uh, bulletproof glass. Interior plates, I could understand. But. Yeah. Alright, there we go. That was weird. I was like phasing through. I was clipping through that uh, armor block a little bit. Until I finally got it. Collect all the things. Grind, 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 grind. Pokemon. Oh, you're putting stuff into the that cargo container as I'm taking stuff out. It's like yeah. it keeps. It seems like it just keeps getting more <laughs> stuff in there. <laughs> it's because it is. Yeah, that, that tends to be how these things work. Okay. Well, I trust was, me, I'm a space engineer. Yes. Um, what we could do is we could build a little cargo ship to move stuff. Wait, 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 wait. Cargo ship or commas cargo ship? Like a small, small little cargo mover with a welder, or a grinder, okay. rather. So an actual cargo ship. That's, that's Not cool. <laughs> Not even. It's like a little shuttle with a grinder on it, with some storage. But that's okay. Anyway, I need to get uh, some more energies, and my oxygen bottle needs to be refilled. I'm at 16% on the uh, the bottle. Um, is it set to auto refill? Not sure. I'll, I'll check that. Oxygen generator. Auto refill is checked. Auto refill checked there. Check there. Actually, where is the oxygen tank? It's got. It actually has a fair amount of oxygen in there. How much? Um, it's filled to 95.4% capacity. Not bad. Not too bad. Come back, you stupid light on. There we go. Yeah. Don't call it stupid. It has feelings, too. Yeah, well, I have feelings, and it was flying away from me. Oh. And that hurt my feelings. Because it didn't want you, I understand. Actually, no, I don't, because everybody wants me. <laughs> I do a sexy hair flip, but I just look stupid because I don't have any hair. Huh. 
Huh. Why do you need a hairbrush when you don't have any hair? Veggie tails. Okay. Veggie tails? No. Yes. Maybe. No. No. You don't have veggie tails in Australia? My God. <laughs> I'm sorry. You should be. It's veggie tails. We don't have it. Do you have television? Do you have television? Say so what? Tele so like some form of newspaper? It's some kind of uh, black magic that puts pictures uh -huh. on your screen. And yeah, it's kind of like a computer. A what? <laughs> That's what I thought. But yeah, they definitely changed how f how much stuff can be in the way to place blocks. Unless I'm just completely derping out, which is always a possibility. I have my moments. I'm gonna go check your videos after this. Okay. Except I don't. I didn't make a video when I um, was building the asteroid base because that was before I was a YouTuber. Uh. I only showcased the aftermath. <laughs> it was that bad? Oh, it's awesome. It's, it's actually... I think it was my first YouTube video on Space Engineers. Okay. I'm pretty sure it was. Yeah. <laughs> Your first ever YouTube video. I, th I think... No, not my first ever. My first ever, actually, is set to unlisted. It's just something that Angus wanted to see on War Thunder. I actually showed it to you. Yes, you did. That, that's what I was laughing I think, at. I think the first public one was um, Kerbal Space Program. KSP. I think that was my Before first Before it was cool. Uh, it was still cool then. Kerbal Space Program has always been cool. Yes, yes it has. <laughs> but um, we're almost out of time here. The video is at, uh, it's about 22 minutes long. So basically the plan, if you've just been completely phasing out or maybe just skip to the end just to see what's going on, I don't know why you would do that, but just in case. Um, we're tearing down this red ship. We're going to be making a little platform here. I'm basically planning on this to be a little hub. I mean, we have uranium here, so that's going to be a pretty important place, especially with the reduced um, efficiency of the assembler. So yeah, that's going to be a thing. I might actually make use of like the efficiency modules for um, the assembler. I haven't used those yet. Apparently they have some for thrusters now, Tobias. Really? Yeah, cool. like, yeah. What do those ones do? I'm not entirely sure. I haven't used those yet either. But, uh, um, yeah, so basically this is going to be a little hub, a little port. It's going to be pressurized. It's going to be nice and cozy. I plan on digging into the asteroid a little bit. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. I have all sorts of decorative mods. I'm, we're going to make this place look nice. Whoops. 0.5% energy. Mm -hmm. Oh, we got to see him die. I may not make this one. You oh, can no, make it. Oh, okay. I deleted the doors. Oh, yeah, so you can make it So faster. I don't get stuck in them anymore. Okay, fair enough. But, yes, don't forget to check out some of my other video series. Um, I mean, something similar to this. Medieval Engineers! Medieval Engineers is pretty awesome. You guys should totally check out those videos. Um, but, yeah. Until next time, though, this is Ryan from Strombully Games. I'm flying up. Okay, I'm signing off.